And here we are with another mat return. So maybe you don't want to have to pick your partner up, your, your training partner, your opponent. You may do something called a broomstick. So the broomstick is called that way because we're putting our legs through and sort of entwining and blocking their legs. What I'm, what I'm doing with this is I'm making it difficult for him to step back and recover his balance with his right foot. Yep, step back. So we're making it hard for him to do that. So I'm behind him. I'm gonna get a grip high here. I'm gonna broomstick. And now I'm gonna hop backward. And it's difficult for him to step back, so he comes down. He's very efficient. I don't have to pick the person up. I don't have to worry about slamming them down in any way. I'm gonna get a high grip, broomstick, and step. Hop back with as many hops as I need in order to get him to the mat. Okay, common mistakes. If I don't stay high on him, this, this goes for almost any kind of mat return. If I start getting low on his body, then even if he goes down, he may end up in top position. So I never want that. We want to be in top position. That's why I'm going to keep this hand high. And you want to stay high as you can. Here. Take as many hops as you need to get him down and get your back control. Okay? So that's the broomstick map return.